Hey Akron Zips fans, I'm Kara Riccardi here at the Student Union to see what students know about their Akron sports. We're going to jump ahead to next semester and ask about our fall sports teams. What is the name of our football team stadium? Um, um, I don't, I don't know. I have no idea. Is it like Envision or something? Info. Infocision. The Infocision Stadium. Infocision Stadium. I'll give you bonus points if you can name the field. Suma Field. There's a different name for the field? There's a name for the field? Still no idea. The field. How many national championships has the soccer team won? Five. Four. Three. Two. One. What is a volleyball team's head coach's name? Starts with an R. I don't know. I know Jim Trussell's the... No, no, no. No idea. I have no idea. In volleyball, what does it mean to be the libero? You serve the volleyball? I'm not sure. It doesn't mean to be the team captain. That you're always going to try to do your best and win. No. As we can see, students are not that prepared for this upcoming season. For ZTV Sports Report, I'm Kara Riccardi. Kara wasn't messing around on her first Zips trivia adventure. Those were some tough questions. You know what else is tough, Parker? Coming to realization that the first half of our show is already over. So that means I'll only get to be your co-host for a little bit longer. Wow, does this mean that you're actually going to be upset when you leave? Parker, don't put me on the spot like that. I'm trying to be nice for the camera. Wow, Bridget, tell me how you really feel. I feel like I'm excited to hear what Sartaj Ojala has in his latest edition of Zip Drill. Way to change the subject, but yes, let's hear about the latest baseball, softball, and football results. And don't forget about track, golf, tennis, and swimming, where UA is making strides at the end of the semester. Welcome to our last edition of Zip Drill, where we take a look at the standings in the MAC. I'm none other than Sartaj Ojala. Let's get this drill underway. We start off by looking at the MAC baseball standings. Akron is unfortunately at the bottom in the East, with their overall record of 9 and 31, with the 6 and 11 conference record. Buffalo in the East, as well as Northern Illinois in the West, are competing for the top spot with their matching 13 and 4 conference record. Checking on softball, we see that our Zips are in fifth place in the MAC East, with their 20 and 25 overall record and their 6 and 11 conference record. Our rivals Kent State is currently at the top in the East, while Ball State is up top in the West. Looking ahead to our sports program for the fall, I caught up with some members of the football team for their impressions of what's to come for the 2013 season. After three straight 1-11 seasons, Terry Bowden's football team is set for another year based on improvement, and defensive coordinator Chuck Amato knows what they have to do to be successful. We've got to play smart. We can't beat ourselves. And we've got to finish the half and the end of a game because that's so, so very important. Just like the coaches, players have seen changes in their performance as well. We're looking a lot better. We've been improving ever since last year, and um, I think we're all coming together well, and it's going to be a good season. We got to finish finish games, and we, we definitely in them, so we just got to finish them this year. So, with the struggles of the past three seasons on all of the players' minds, one word has kept them set on their goal. Our word that we've been using is commitment. We want everyone committed, on the field, off the field, in between plays, on the sidelines. You know what I mean? If you got someone that's dialed in 100%, 100% every single day, you're going to have a bunch of good players and a great team. Akron opens up the season on the road against UCF, and even if their season doesn't end with a MAC championship. Coach Amato just wants one thing. We just want to get better. And if we get better as a team, and we get a, these, these guys, and they really are, they get a, a, a real, true, genuine love for one another because we are a team. You know, we're going to improve and we're going to make a lot of people, you know, in this area, you know, proud. Optimism is certainly in the air for the Zips in the upcoming 2013 season. And with Terry Bowden finally having a full year with the Zips under his belt, the only way the team can go is up. Because obviously, the ultimate goal is to fill this case with more trophies. Welcome back. Let's get right to it and check up on the other teams here at the University of Akron. Running over to track at the Ashland Alumni Open, Kyle Wheeler placed second in the 5,000 meter run, while Nate Cronister placed second in the long jump. Sarah Baker came in first in the 5,000 meter run for women's, and Noel Bradley placed in second in the long jump. Swinging over to golf, we find our Lady Zips placed seventh in the MAC semifinal. Laura Murray tied for 16th overall with the final score of 238 while being 22 over par. 
Finally, we look at tennis and we find Akron falling to Bowling Green in the 2013 MAC semifinal 4-2. Pantusart Eshkundina were our top performers in the match. The swimming and diving team have been hard at work improving themselves for their next season. Our own Ksenia Berestetska checks to see how they are doing by challenging one of them to a race. Hi, I'm Ksenia Berestetska and today we're at the swimming pool. I'm going to challenge one of the University of Akron swimmers and see if I can beat her in race. Hi, I'm Erin Seiler. I'm a freshman on the swimming and diving team. Erin was a four-time first team All-Pac-10 conference selection. She was a four-time district qualifier. And also, Erin was qualified for the state meet as a junior in the 100-meter fly and 100-meter breast. As you can see, Erin is a very talented swimmer. However, I got some background in sports as well. I started playing tennis and swimming when I was six years old. Although I chose tennis as my future career, I kept on swimming and finished fifth at the Ukrainian National Championship and Mount Juniors on the distance of 200 meter breaststroke. I'm very excited to compete with Senior right now and we're going to have a lot of fun. Take your mark. Go! I have to say it was a crazy race and I have no words. I'm so tired right now and I think I'm just gonna go to bed and take a nap. It was a good race, now I have to go to practice and it was a good warm up. Well, I guess I'm done for today and for the ZTV Sports Report, Ksenia Beristetska. That's unfortunately all the time we have for this final edition of Zip Drill. But don't worry, we will be back in the fall and you have not seen the last of me. However, we still have some time left on this edition of the ZTV Sports Report after the break. The ZTV Sports Report, your home for University of Akron Athletics. We'll be right back.